BJJ champion Gabby Garcia accuses husband of domestic violence. In today's video, we'll explore the thrilling case of Gabby Garcia, an acclaimed BJJ champion who accuses her husband of domestic violence. Does this abuse involve physical assaults and threatening death threats against her family? What does Gabby have to say about these distressing incidents? Let's jump right into the video and explore the troubling situation further. Gabby Garcia, a renowned mixed martial arts fighter and nine-time Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu world champion, recently discovered that she has been a victim of abuse for the past two years. Through her personal Instagram, Garcia made serious allegations against her estranged husband, Bruno Almeida, accusing him of physically assaulting her during their relationship. The shocking revelations were accompanied by a series of distressing images shared by Gabby. Garcia, since risen 14 in 2018, publicly accused her husband, Bruno Almeida, of not only physical abuse but also fraud and financial exploitation on various social media platforms. Additionally, she posted video clips showcasing injuries she claimed to have sustained as a result of domestic abuse on her Instagram account. Alongside the visuals, Garcia made disturbing accusations, asserting that Almeida physically assaulted her and committed theft against her. Furthermore, she accused Almeida of making death threats. Captions in the video, a champion provided her fans and followers with some contextual information about the situation. The time has come. It's time to be brave and tell everyone why I've been away for the past two years, Garcia wrote. They were the worst years of my life, but I'll show all the details at the end of this week. I didn't think this could ever happen. That somebody could be so bad, a criminal, a person who has committed crimes before and after he was with me, a person who has money and asked for pensions, my earnings, asking for my house, using the name Garcia, married with a son and using my last name, the person who says she is a child of God, who went to my wedding and wrote, God bless you, is still his lover. Because that guy won't divorce me, even with a restraining order and the Maria de Pena law, a Brazilian law created to protect women, victims of domestic violence, by my side, he didn't stop. There are 19 cases of fraud on my credit card, closed my accounts in three different banks. I would get home to no water, no power. He took the money from my payments. I had to go to court to prove that I'm the owner of my house. He lied to his lawyer by saying that it was rented. He asked for my channel earnings, my purse collection, pension. He had people intimidating me. Job? He doesn't have one. He lives on allowances from his mother. I'm posting everything. We have to believe in the law. My parents have depression. I can't leave my house. I still have to put a finish to some wars though. I'll tell my fans every single detail so I can help women who have been abused. As of the current update, Almeida has not made any public statements addressing Garcia's allegations, and it appears that, at this time, their marriage remains intact. What are your thoughts about these accusations? Must share your thoughts in the comment section.